More and more asking for plastic surgery gifts and the trend is growing even here in Richmond. I'm great, how are you? Danette Anderson's Christmas wish list is ready to go. And this year her husband's gift is exactly what she wanted. Anderson's active in the pageant world. She's the Mrs. Virginia 2013 first runner up. There's always pressure to look her best, so Anderson wants to try something new. It was a perfect gift. <laughs> you get tired of the same old bottle of wine or uh, you know, any other gift that you might give somebody, so why not give them a facial peel or a little Botox or a gift certificate? Dr. Bert Sundin has seen a spike in this kind of holiday giving over the past few years, creating a boom in his business and other practices like it. There were 14.6 million cosmetic procedures across the U.S. in 2012, according to the American Society of Plastic Surgeons. That's about an 85% increase from a decade ago, and numbers aren't expected to drop anytime soon. You just get this subtle elevation of the brow. Many treatments like the one Anderson's asking for are non-invasive. But Dr. Sundance has inquiries about everything come in this time of year. If plastic surgeons can do it, someone wants it for Christmas. Sometimes people get their procedures before the holidays and sometimes they get their little gifts and come in afterwards and get them. Anderson likes what she heard at this consult and knows her Christmas gift appointment won't be her last. She's already looking forward to her next birthday. Yeah, more Botox. <laughs> What kind of price tag can you expect? There is a wide range. Injectables like Botox will cost you a few hundred dollars. A breast lift or tummy tuck runs well into the thousands.